Welcome. This is Dr. James Beckett, Sports Card Insights, here with a card wall video, starting with Rick Berry. As you know, I do them in alphabetical order. This is the fifth panel out of uh, 80, I guess. But uh, Rick Berry, announcer card, probably 500 copies. Got this probably 90, 91, somewhere around in there. I got it directly from, from Hoops, I believe. So great card, great condition. Uh, he'll probably stay on the wall. Uh, again, he's uh, an excellent announcer. Hank Bauer, probably not going to be on the next iteration of the wall, but I like the card back in the day. This is in the first iteration. Uh, 52 tops, one of the classic, classic sets. Uh, it's a nice condition card. Uh, Sammy Baugh, Sling and Sammy from TCU. That's local. That gives extra points for why he would be uh, you know, main, maintaining his position on the wall. It's pers not personally autographed, but it is signed, uh, a certified autograph from back, back then. So, um, Roddy Babois, um, uh, just a athletic freak, but uh, not able to maintain his, uh, excellence over the course of, uh, a season or a career, but he had some great, great moments. He'll be on the wall until he is supplanted, which will happen. My wife and I were at the, at the game where he went off. And so, uh, we, we both have fond memories of the best of Roddy. Uh, this is, uh, homage to my soccer friends and I like soccer too, but there's Franz Beckenbauer, uh, one of the greatest of all time, a German, midfielder and uh, that's probably going to be on the wall for a long time uh, this is another Beckett uh, centric card not all the cards are but this is a Beckett's victim of a of a corner in a race in uh, Great Britain I guess and I, I don't think this is going to make the wall but it's going to be an interesting card for a little while uh, Cricket card. I think I'm going to keep this card on for a long time. Uh, it's E. E. A Beckett, uh, kind of an Australian cricket card. So thank you for that. I like that. I know we're going to pick that up a long time ago. This is my Topps rookie card, even though it's in uh, gem mint condition. It is getting bounced from the wall in favor of, uh, because the preference is for a pack pulled card. Now, this is not the same as the fan favorites card that you may have seen that was uh it's it's more plentiful this is the one that was pack pulled and certified autographed that actually was presented at a contract with tops they brought a witness representative person over the office back in the day 15 plus years ago and i had to uh, sign them in their presence and for my uh, i didn't get very much money but i got a couple of the autograph cards and i got this one slabbed and uh and it's a cool card uh, okay, another uh, Beckett card. Uh, this is Joe Beckett. Looks like he says a heavyweight. He looks like a middleweight to me, but uh, he was he was a, a bruising boxer back in the day. And I'll keep him on the wall for a while. After it all, is is my wall. Uh, Chuck Bednarik, great great two way player. Back when they didn't do much in the way of padding, he dished it out uh, quite a bit. And uh, you know he he's he's. You know, the uniform notwithstanding, he's probably somebody. I wanted to thank sponsors. Probably would do this even without sponsors, but it's fun to have sponsors that I have confidence in and like to give a shout out to. Uh, you may notice that uh, I left out Elgin Baylor. He's in the next queue of things at BGS. And I'm, I'm on a wait and see for OBJ of uh, Odell Beckham Jr. We'll see how he uh, finishes up, uh, but he's a possibility. So thanks, everybody. And I'll have another panel uh, tomorrow.